how to make your money grow and how all of you can be part of our billion dollar plan. So we're just at Vince's place at the moment and we were talking about how companies have literally grown from nothing to multi-billion dollar companies. So I'll tell you a little bit more about that um, later as we get onto this, this Facebook Live. But if you've just joined, then just say hi. And uh, do me a favor, uh, give me some likes and comments just so I know that you are, that this is working okay. Because your internet is, is pretty fast, right? Yeah, it's 100 yeah. Uh, meg. 100 meg line. <laughs> right. So we've got Joby uh, Young watching. If, you, if this is working, just type in yes, just so I can um, see that this is working. And we want to talk about how you can make your money grow for you and how you can be part of our billion dollar plan. And by the way, if you just join, say hi and let me know where you're dialing from and I'll give you a shout out. So we've got uh, Mihir, we've got Mazu, Eleni, we've got uh, Tan Ketlun. Hey, hey, Ketlun, how you doing? We've got Kerry, we've got Barton. Kerry Barton, we've got Mia. Right, so Vince, we wanna, I wanna ask you a question. Um, People, when they work in a job, they, they earn a living, right? So they earn an income. So we've all been taught to go to school, get a job, and earn an income. But where do most people spend their money? Well, to start with, everybody has to pay rent uh, or mortgage, and then the daily essentials. And uh, but that, that's the sensible part. I think a lot of people spend money on the luxuries, like handbags, toys, gadgets, holidays. Um, well, basically, they spend every penny they earn. <laughs> right. So what we're trying to say is that most people spend the money on things that go down in value, not up in value. So they invest in what we call liabilities rather than assets. So Vince, just give people an idea. Um, what sort of assets could people be investing in to actually make more money? Well, anything that appreciates in value. Have you got um, anything in here that appreciates? House. House. <laughs> it's got a beautiful house um, here. <laughs> house and businesses, perhaps. Yeah. Um, well, any, well uh, gold, any, commodities, anything that has the potential to go up in value. Antiques? Any antiques? Yeah. Well, for example, my, my antique clock over there. Um, Let me have a look. I think it's gone up by, like, you know... 500% since I bought it like 500%. three years ago. All right, so nice um, antiques. And, and my paintings, which are wrapped up in a moment because uh, yeah. we, we're just getting them refurbished. Um, things go in value, paintings, yeah. antiques, um, not cars, <laughs> <laughs> nor boats, anything that floats or, or, or runs around, I think trying to avoid. Yeah, so let's talk about um, Let's talk about where most of you spend your money right now. So let me ask all of you, where do you spend your money? Like, like, like what things do you spend your money on? Do you spend things that go up in value or down in value? So if you just join, say hi, by the way, and I'll give you a shout out. And let me know where you're dialing in from. We've got Jen Campbell. Hello to you both. We've got uh, Cassie Joby Young. Hey, Joby. How's Karen? I hope she's well. We've got Rajo Tang. We've got Kerry Barton, Child Care. We got uh, Eve. Hey, Eve, how you doing? Say hi to Eve. Hi, Eve. <laughs> um, uh, Jim says, "Nice clock." Is it clock? Yeah, it's, clock. it's a clock. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So <laughs> it's it's a eight, um, it's a eighteenth century. Eighteenth century. Yeah. Wow. Um, uh, Kerry says photography equipment. Valum says education. Kelly Tan says hi. Oh yeah, that's a good one. We got uh, intangible assets. Yes, yes. Um, actually, education is is one of the biggest investments you can make. And a lot of you who join us on our um, events Sorry, and, you and, drink. And, and you and you invest in your education, you know that's that's one of the biggest investments you can make. But you know, in this Facebook Live, we're going to talk about how all of you can be a part of our billion dollar plan. But before I talk about that, let me tell you some of the things that I invest in. So I invest in a lot of property. I invest a lot of IP, so intellect. There are actually four things you want to start investing in. Number one is uh, P for property, I for intellectual property. All right, we've got another P for paper assets, and we have B for business. So I put a lot of my money into property, business, and, in and intellectual property. All right, so intellectual property is something that you can do on a consistent basis that um, no one else can do, right, or very few people can do. So that's what we call I. Now, Vince, there's, 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 there's one thing, there's a concept, and when a lot of people invest in businesses, is it best to invest in business right at the start, or is it best to invest in business uh, right at the end? Um, if you invest in a startup, the chances uh, you're going to lose 
money because I think you, you've seen that st statistics show that up to 90% of businesses fail in the first 18 months. Yeah. Um, so that's risky, but the reward could also be tremendous. Yeah. But you, you're talking about a long shot. Um, businesses are already successful, of course, the, uh, the premium's already in the price. So yeah. you're, you're paying a premium for it. Yeah. So I think the best time for investing in a business is just before it's about to take off. So it's yeah. gone through all the, what we call the J curve, uh, yeah. the trials and tribulations for a business that survive after a number of years. It's about to take off. That's the moment. Right. So what Vince is saying there is you want to find a business that if you want to invest, there's two things you can do. Number one, you can either um, start your own business, which takes a lot of blood, sweat and tears, right, Vince? Mm, no, I know too well about that. <laughs> or you find somebody else who's successful and you invest in their business so you don't have to do the work. In fact, that's what Warren Buffett does, isn't he? Warren Buffett, um, the reason why he's a multi-billionaire is because he's got his finger in a lot of pies and he has a lot of people investing. Uh, he invests in a lot of people's companies and they just do the hard work. By the way, if, you've, say. if you've joined, then just say hi. Oh, by the way, um, do me a favor, by the way, because this is really, really important Facebook Live because we've got a, a little bit of an announcement to make, which is pretty big and there's a deadline to this. So in the bottom left-hand corner, there's going to be a share button. So if you click share for me and just type in share, and I'll give you a shout out. So we've got um, Nazir says, are you fine? We've got Nahir says, hello, sir. Velem says, happy claps. Kevin says, good morning, fellas. Adam says, hey, what's up? Uh, we've got Ji Siang Tan says, hi. Um, Kevin says, Buffett uh, researches what he invests in as well. Absolutely right. Um, Adam says, hi, it's me. Hey, Adam, how you doing? Um, Jen says, already, Jen Campbell already shared. Thank you so much. Uh, Mai Ho says, hi, John, how you doing? So we want to talk about how you guys can be involved in the billion dollar plan. And, and I'm going to tell you a little bit about this. So, you know, for those of you that kind of missed the um, beginning of this, we talked about how, what, how do you make your money grow for you and how do you, um, how can you be part of a billion dollar plan? We've got Morella who's just trying to say hi to Morella. Hi, Morella. Yeah, Morella, you're doing really well. Good job. So most people, they spend the money on assets and a lot, a lot of people try and save money. Let, let me give you another concept. S you've all been taught to save money for a rainy day. If, if you've ever been taught that before, type in yes. If you've ever been taught that before, type in yes. We've got um, Henry that's joined from Bali with Scooters, you know, the, the little mopeds. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Hope that's going well for you, Henry. We've got Mary. we got, um, come on, let us know how we can get rich together. <laughs> Henry says, hi from Bali. We're missing Bali. Oh, Carol's right. just joined. So hi to Carol. Oh, Carol. Hi. <laughs> hey. <laughs> hope you're well and hope the little one's well. So um, we talk about a lot of people, they save money for a rainy day. When in actual fact, we need to be investing money for a rainy day. You see, try and take a guess how long it takes. Like if the average person saves 300 pounds a month and you want to save up, 100,000 pounds, guess how much or how long it would take you. And anyone take a guess, just type in the number of years it would take you to save up 100,000 pounds if you save 300 pounds every single month, All right? Let, let's see who gets this right. We've got Ralph on the Philippines, and we've got, and here says yes. If you just join, by the way, let me know where you're dialing in from. We've got Andre from Indonesia. Um, Morella says, hey guys, thank you for being such a good gift to the world. Uh, Marella, thank you so much. We've got Amrit, Amrit Y, right? It says, hello, John and Vincent. So Janet says, 27 years. So Janet, you have done your calculations. So um, if you save 300 pound uh, a month, that's 3,600 pounds a year. And if you divide that by uh, 100,000 pounds, that is 27 years, right? Now, for a, if you want to save up 1 million pounds, it's going to take you 277 years. So I don't know about you, Vince, unless there's some kind of like miracle pill that you can take to live forever, it's going to be pretty impossible to do that. So where do people make their million, millions? How do they grow their money? They do it by investing in companies. They do it by investing in themselves. You see, there's three rules of money. Number one, if you want to become rich, you have to become a producer. So you've got to produce something that the market wants. Number two, you have to, you have to create some kind of system that can scale. And number three, you have to have something that the market actually wants. So we've been doing some research, and would you like to know what Vince and I have been working on? If you do, then type in yes. Type in yes. We've got uh, Overdue's just joined as well. Uh, Carol Ying says, hello, John and Vince. Hey, Carol. Hi, Carol. Well. So here's the thing. What, what's one of the biggest trends right now that you notice that everybody's doing right now? 
One word, technology. Okay, so what technology is, is, is sort of booming right now? Well, anything that disrupts the market and, and sort of rocks the status quo. If you look at um, Uber, right? Nobody is hailing a black cap in, in the rain anymore. You know, you, you, get, you get driven from door to door without even having to pull out your wallet. Look at Airbnb. You don't have to stay in expensive hotels, right? Mm, yeah. Um, so there are quite a number of uh, business models that you, through technology, you can change the way people operate things and it enhances people's lives. Yeah. That's what we're looking at. Yeah. So you, I want you all to take a guess. What's one of the biggest technology companies right now that streams film, right? That streams film. So if you can just type that in for me and we'll all take a guess because we're live right now from uh, Vince's place. So uh, anything that we're gonna do, I'm gonna actually read this up. We've got Kevin Leverage in Technology. Mohammed says yes. Andy Gray says hello from Indonesia. Uh, Henry says um, um, electric scooter technology, okay. Uh, is, is booming, absolutely right. Uh, Kevin says YouTube. So YouTube has now become the biggest search, one of the second biggest search engine in the world. And let me tell you something like that. And Sandra says, Netflix, you got it. You got it. Not Blockbusters. Not Blockbusters. In fact, did, did you know that Blockbuster was offered Netflix many years ago and, and Blockbuster turned them down because when they said to them, oh, you know, I've got a really cool idea to stream video. And people said, no one's ever gonna watch video. Um, on their mobile phone. Let me ask you all a question. We're gonna do a test now, right? How many of you have watched a video on your mobile phone? If you if you have, type in me, type in me. So we've got Jennifer says uh, Amazon. We've got a pan says hello from Kuching. Hey, how you doing, Kuching? I love Kuching. Um, by the way, if you just joined and uh, just say hi and let me know where you are dialing in from, and we'll give you a shout out. Anyone travel really far? We've got Pete Scott on here. Pete's on here. Pete. Hey, P, are you, are you still in Thailand? You're still in Thailand. Kevin says, Blockbuster didn't evolve with the trend and tanked. You're absolutely right. In fact, Kevin, if you go back... Yeah, they got Blockbusted. In fact, if you do a, a search on the Blockbuster share price, you'll find that the share price actually um, has gone like this. Right? So why are we telling you this? We've got Vinny that says... Uh, Vinny Yap says, hi. Um, Dora, hey, Dora, how you doing? And um, we got Nigel from Newcastle. By the way, so when we talk about this, how a lot of you can be a part of our billion dollar plan, do me a favor, in the bottom left hand corner, I want you to click the share button. And once you've shared, just type in the word share. And what I'll do is I'll give you a shout out. And if you're liking what we're talking about so far, give us some thumbs up and give us some love hearts. Uh, we've got Jennifer, we've got Alex, we've got Pete Scott says, what's up brothers? Yeah, Jamie, Panda and me are watching and flying back tomorrow. Wow, say hi to Jamie for me. And any of you who haven't seen Jamie's YouTube channel, go and check it out, it's, it's so funny. So let me tell you about some of the things that Wealth Dragons and Vince and I have been working on for the last three and a half years. A, a bit of background, when did we start Vince? Um, 2008. 2008, and we officially started the company in, uh, in 2009, yes. right? So, um, how did, how, what is Wealth Dragons and what do Wealth Dragons actually do? Well, as the name suggests, we help people create wealth and wealth is not just about money, it's about being the best version of yourself. It's about uh, maximizing the potential that you've been endowed with and then you create as much wealth as possible and give it all back. This is pretty much what uh, our motto is. Yep, and one of my mottos is that we should not be earning uh, money and trading time for money. We should have money work really hard for us. So what Wealth Dragons do is we actually run seminars and we run mentoring programs where we teach people the necessary skills into create number one, to create more wealth in their life, and number two, to go from earning earned income into passive income. But what's the problem with this business model, Vince? Well, we have been running um, well, over 500 seminars uh, in different countries and you know, it's pretty tiring and a lot of people think that seminar business is, is, oh, is really good, it makes a lot of money. In fact, we, we do it just so that we can build a network and, and, and give an opportunity to, to people and open doors. And there are only so many places me and John can go to. And, and in order for us to penetrate the market and give education to everybody, we need to utilize technology. Right. So... Um, l let me ask you right now. So how many of you in the UK, if you're in the UK, just type in UK. And if you're not in the UK, type in 
not UK. And we'll do a little test here to see how many of you are actually from these areas. We've got Evelyn's, put a hand up. We've got Ming Ling says, happy Friday. Jennifer says, education, education, education. You're absolutely right. So here's the thing that, that Vince and I decided to do. For the last three and a half years, we decided to work on a e-learning platform, which is valued at how much now? How, how much is the e-learning e -learning um, industry? Right now, it's estimated at 200 million and it's set to billion. Oh, sorry, 200 billion, <laughs> yeah. which is a lot of uh, billions. <laughs> yeah. And it's set to double in the next seven years. Right. So that's what we want to capture. That's what, we, that's what we want to get involved in. We want to get into a market where the market is growing and where the market is getting bigger and bigger. Um, we had a guy that just flew to our seminar. And where did he fly from? Australia. Australia. That was a 34-hour flight to fly from Australia. We've had people fly from um, India, um, the US, um, Singapore, Malaysia to come to our events. But the problem is not everybody can come. And when they do come, not everybody can afford to you know, have a coach or a mentor in the life. So what we decided to do is we decided to create the first ever self-development platform in the world that will teach the things that we teach, right? So it's kind of like, if you want to learn how to go to med school, like you want to become a lawyer, you go to law, law school. You want to become a doctor, you go to medical school. You want to become financially free, you want to earn passive income, create more wealth in your life, you come to Wealth Dragons. And you know we've changed many, many lives around the world and you know we have a lot of students who now have quit their jobs full time and now started their own businesses and now doing what they love. And this e-learning platform is really to help billions of people around the world in order to uh, really get that knowledge that was never taught to us at school. Now Vince, if I, if I was to ask you, um, what is different between our platform and say YouTube? Well, YouTube is very scattered, isn't it? And, and everybody can open a channel on YouTube dispensing advice. So the standards vary. If you really don't have the time to scour through YouTube to find useful information, you want information that's already been censored and, and been filtered out and is focused. Mm. And especially in business and entrepreneurship, which is what we're uh, specialized in. Uh, you know, a lot of people who talk about business entrepreneurship on YouTube have never even run a business before, right? Mm. Let alone being successful in them. So um, w when people come to us, we make sure that anyone who teaches through our platform has been vetted personally by me and you. Yeah. And we know that they, they have achieved success and they genuinely have something to offer. And that will save you time and it will save you money. Yeah. And one of the things that we decided to do, like in this industry, if you want to learn how to do this, you have to pay between 100 and 500 pounds just for a course to learn this stuff. And what we wanted to do was take all the courses in the world on business, entrepreneurship, self-development, you know, how to invest in property, how to make passive income. And we decided to give everybody worldwide access for just, listen to this, £9.99 a month. <gasps> £9.99 a month, which is like that completely disrupts the whole industry. And, uh, and, and, and you want to add something to yeah, that? Yeah, but because um, through the years we've had people from some of the most obscure places in the world asking if we're going to their countries to teach what we teach back here in the United Kingdom. And we, we kind of said, yes, we hope to one day, but there's so many countries in the world. And, and we really want to give an opportunity to people in far corners of the earth, in some poor countries where £10 or $10 a month is not a problem and they can access all the information they need to get some people out of poverty or to give themselves an opportunity to learn new things. Um, so this, again, is, is a disruptive model. Yeah. By the way, if you believe that you know, when you have an important mess message to share and you have knowledge that can better someone's life, it's your duty to give it. Right, it's your duty to teach others. Would you agree? Type in yes, give me some thumbs up, and give me some love arts. We got Toshan says, hey guys, I miss you, hope we'll all see you well. Vishnu, we got Vishnu on here. Oh yeah, hi. <laughs> yeah, it's been a while. If you just join, by the way, say hi, and do me a favor, share this live right now, and um, so we can educate all the people around in your life. So, what is this billion dollar plan that we're talking about? Well, as a lot of you know or don't know, that we've created and that's you know one of the reasons why we've done this we've created a online and someone said did you say curses or courses courses online e-learning courses where you can learn about business and entrepreneurship without flying around the world right so our goal is to get a million people onto this platform and a million people paying 10 pounds a month is actually how much it is 10 mil it's um 
10 million a month and then it is 120 million a year. Now, one of the things that we're doing and, and, and with Vince and I, um, and this is a little bit of an announcement for those of you that don't know, that we are planning to take Wealth Dragons to a stock exchange in London this year. IPO, yes. So you all have the opportunity to be a part of this, but there's a problem. The problem is that there's a deadline, right? There's a deadline which is going to be the 28th of February, right? Now, I don't know about you, but I don't know how many times you get the opportunity to invest in a company with huge growth, with huge potential, and also with two great entrepreneurs backing it and being behind this. So this is how you can invest with us into Wealth Dragons, and you just let Vince and I do all the hard work. Now, what does IPO actually mean, and what's the benefit okay. for everyone watching? Um, you know, the difference between a private company and a public company is that the shares in a public company can be bought and sold through a recon recognized stock exchange. So when a company goes to a stock exchange for the first time, where the shares are put up for, uh, for, pub for, for the public to, to purchase, and that's called an initial public offering. Or IPO. Okay, so why is that beneficial for people to, to invest before an IPO? Well, um, normally you find that a lot of companies that go public for the first time, their share price uh, tends to go up. So that means there is an opportunity that you could come in at this stage before the, pub, uh, before the official listing that you can actually buy the shares at a discount. So by the time we go to the market, you've already made money. And that's the plan. Yeah, of course, there's no guarantee. Yeah, and we can't guarantee that. But what we will guarantee is that Vince and I will not sleep until we turn Wealth Dragons Online and the Wealth Dragons Group PLC into a billion dollar company. And for those, those of you who follow me on Instagram, if you're not, head over to Instagram and type in John Lee and follow me because you'll see how hard we work when we actually put in our effort and our, our passion and our time. So this is really an opportunity for all of you to invest in a company, number one, with huge growth, with e-learning, and number two, to invest in a company before it goes public. Right before it goes public, so there's a deadline. Now there is a benefit. So Vince has worked really hard on something called EIS. Vince, you want to explain what EIS is to people and what the benefit uh, is? Well, firstly, EIS is running out at the end of this month, and EIS is a scheme uh, that has been sanctioned by uh, our Her Majesty Revenue and Custom or HMRC, allowing investors to invest in a, um, a company where that there is already an um, EIS scheme in place to get tax relief up to 30%. So in other words, if you invest £100,000 in a company, £30,000 will come back to your pocket by HMRC uh, as, a, as a relief uh, from your taxation. And the, the idea is for the government to encourage people to invest for themselves for the future, and, and that takes away the burden from, from the state. And also for you to have an opportunity to invest in a company that is going through high growth. Yeah. And by the way, we don't, off just, we don't just offer this opportunity to anyone. The reason why we're offering it to my community is that all of you, for the millions of people that follow me on social media, for those of you who've attended my events, for those of you who have purchased our programs, our mentoring, this is our way to give back to you to say thank you for supporting our journey all the way to where we are right now. And also thank you for allowing us and following our work and our mission and our vision to really educate the next generation. Right, so um, for those, and someone's asking, where can we buy the shares? Okay, so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put a link on this. I'm gonna try and type at the same time. So www.wdipo.com. Oh, .com. So I'm gonna post that right there right now. So you should be able to see a link. So the link is www wdipo.com. So what I want you all to do right now is I want you to go to um, that, that website now because it's by application only, by the way. I'm just taking a screen grab of this just so I can see this. Uh, hold on a second, let me take a screen grab. There we go. wdipo.com, right? And when you go there, put your first name, last name, email address, and telephone number, and also there's gonna be amount that you wanna invest, okay? So by the way, it's no obligation, just go there, because we, we need to speak to every single person about this. This offer is not offered to anyone outside of my community. You'll, you'll only ever hear about this if you follow me on Facebook, if you've attended our events, if you have bought, read our books, 
if you follow me on YouTube, it's only going out to my community because this is mine and Vincent's way to actually give back to all of you. Let me ask you a Vincent, uh, Vince uh, question. What is our mission in life for Wealth Dragons? What, what do we want to do? We want to make education available to everybody. It's that simple. Um, at the moment, when people want to learn something, they have to either read a book or they have to attend a seminar and, and, and they're not cheap and it's not always convenient for everybody. So um, our objective right now is to make the world a better place. We want business and entrepreneurship uh, education to be available to everybody. Not that everyone has to start a business, but we want people to be uh, a better version of themselves. In fact, in, in fact, being the best version of themselves. And people know that there is another way, apart from doing a nine to five job or being in a rat race, that there is a way out, should that be the option. So that's what we want. Yep. And you know, um, I come up, I mean, Vince and I both come from a, a Chinese family. And you know, my, my, my parents always wanted to become a doctor or become a lawyer or, you know, they want me to just do the traditional stuff. But for me, my, way, my brain's not wired for that. I want to do something I was passionate about. And I think too many people, they're just existing. They're not living. You know, they just kind of walk around in life just doing enough to get by. Whereas if you're passionate about something, you've got that little, you know, fire in your belly that you want to get out there to the world and do something amazing that's going to make a huge difference and impact. You know, I, I, a couple of years ago, I personally had a conversation with Leonardo DiCaprio. And I said to Leo, I said, you know, Leo, one of the things that I love about what you, what you do is you're not just a celebrity and you're rich and you're just doing all this, you know, celebrity stuff, but you're, you're making a fortune and you're making a difference. And that's what it's about. It's about make a fortune and make a difference. And if all of you come up with that mindset where you love to do the things you do, this is like for me, you know, all my friends and family, oh, when we're sat around there, um, uh, 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 chat, you know, we go to dim sum, we have some you know, Chinese food. My parents will always say something like, oh, you know, wh wh where do your son go to school? Oh, we go, my son goes to Cambridge or my daughter goes to Oxford. You know, I want one day for people to say, you know, where, like your kids, where do they want to go? And I want them to say, I want them to go to the Wealth Dragon School of Financial Freedom. Do you want a coffee? Coffee? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. They're not going to be too noisy. This has got all these, like, funny... Caffeine, I'm trying to stay oh, off, I'm I, trying I, to stay I, off I, caffeine, though. I can't live without my Nespresso. I'm trying to stay off caffeine, though. Decaf. Decaf. You want decaf? Does that, it's, it's got no caffeine. Uh, decaf it, means no caffeine. But does it taste the same, though? Yeah. Are you sure? Yeah. <laughs> anyone, like, anyone here like espresso? If you do, give me some love hearts and give me some uh, thumbs up. So, yeah, if, um, it, for, for those of you that would like to invest, um, oh, the sun has just gone. I'm going to take a screen grab of this because I've just got the link there just so we can see it. Because um, a lot of you cannot see the link. So the, for those of you that want to invest in my company that I've invested in, that Vince has invested in. By the way, just so you know, Vince and I are the biggest shareholders of Wealth Dragons right now, right? So what does that mean? It means that when we make money, you make money. When you make money, we make money. So yeah. our values are completely aligned. Yeah, yeah. And we make money together. Yeah, because Vince and I are the biggest uh, stakeholders in Wealth Dragons. We, we own the most shares. Um, you know, I want a lot. I'm giving all of you the opportunity to be a part of this. So when we push up the share price, so every time you see me make a post on Facebook, every time you come to one of our events, every time you see one of my YouTube videos, every time you read our book, you see our books in the bookstore, you know that that's part of your company. So you become a Wealth Dragons yes, shareholder. Thank you so much. Wow. Thank you. So this is definitely decaf, right? Yeah, definitely decaf. I've never really tasted decaf before. It's the same. Is it? Why don't, why don't people just drink decaf all the time then? Because they want a caffeine. Yeah. I, I want a caffeine first. So it tastes the same, so I'm not going to get a kick from this. No, it's just a taste, it's flavour, it's, it's a habit. It's like, a, like vaping for a, you know, serious smoking. All right. By the way, if you just join, say hi. I want to give you all a shout out. We've got Bobby Hang says, enjoy your coffee. We've got Sarah that's joined. We've got Jen. Jen Campbell says she'll have one, please. <laughs> oh, okay, right up. <laughs> <laughs> we've got Toshan. We've got... Um, Wow, we've got quite a lot of you watching. We've got, is mine ready, Vince? Which one do you want? <laughs> um, yeah. Um, yeah. Let's talk a little bit about our team. Like, so we want to get Wealth Dragons. Our goal is to get Wealth Dragons to a $1 billion company, right? So that's what we want to do. But the question is, how, why are we so confident that we can do this? Um, 
A business actually has many aspects it, uh, when it comes to achieving success. You have to have the right team. From the top down, you have the right board of directors who are the generals of the company making decisions. And then you have people in mid-management to execute your plans. And we have to make sure that the company is transparent, is investable, and we have a business plan that is robust and, and is scalable. And so all these factors put together and also with our track records and the brand equity. And I think a lot of people have heard of Well Dragons, a brand that we have built over the years, since 2009. Yeah. So we, we build on what we've achieved and the timing. You know, business is about timing. And right now we feel that this is exactly the, the time when we can take the company to the next level. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So a lot of you that want to be a part of this, just remember this Facebook Live we're doing now and say, damn, I had an opportunity to be a part of that company. It's kind of like if you'd have invested in um, Facebook, right? Or in fact, Apple. Apple in 1998, the share price was like, like $7 or something like that. But if you'd have invested in that company, you'd be very happy now. Right? If you look at Amazon, Amazon share price is like $1,400 per share, but back then it was very, very cheap. Right? So you had an opportunity to get in back then. Now, our goal is when we go public, we go from private to a public company. But, and, and also as well, a lot of you may be asking, John, why are you raising money for your company? Well, Wealth Dragons Online, uh, the first thing we want to do is we want to grow the operations. We want to create more uh, online courses so more and more people will join but we also want to create something called Wealth Dragons Exclusive so I'm going to ask Vince what Wealth Dragons Exclusive are in fact Vince you're going to be running a Wealth Dragons Exclusive for your property events right? Oh so, yeah, yeah if you look at uh, Netflix uh, Netflix has thousands and thousands of movies but they're not all that good alright I mean you've got some great ones um, but now they, they are starting to produce their own Netflix original movies to make sure that the quality is, is the highest. And that's exactly what we're doing. While we include a lot of trainers who've got something unique to offer in their fields of expertise, we also produce the Well Dragons exclusive, the Well Dragons original courses, uh, where we, we make sure that everything that we put in these programs are of the highest quality so that you get, get the best enjoyment. Actually, one of the things that you're going to be doing is like, because you built a multi-million pound prop portfolio. Yeah. And you're going to actually be showing people uh, actually how you do that. Yeah. So uh, just to, let's talk a little bit about that because this is an example of um, a Wealth Dragons online ex exclusive where, you know, this is, you can't find this content anywhere else. In fact, one of my missions is to find lots of very interesting people with interesting business models. For example, there's one guy I know and he makes around 250,000 pounds a year from Instagram, right? So my goal is to find all these very successful people and these very successful entrepreneurs and take their business models and teach them to everybody in the world because I believe that everybody needs to have all these different strategies and all these things that can really help make an impact to the world. And one thing that Vincent and I truly believe is that if you help more people make money, you will make more money at the same time. If you agree, type in yes. Give me some love hearts. Give me some love hearts. All right. Um, we've got a lot of questions coming in here. Let's have a look. Um, Jana Khan says, Hi, John. Love to see you both. Thank you so much. Um, can you guys speak Chinese? Desmond says, Can you speak Chinese? All sick gong gong no All sick gong seal seal. But Mandarin, can, can you speak some Mandarin? Uh, you damn damn. Uh, well, uh, short up. 不太好一点我会说中文一点 anyone else speak Chinese on here? okay if you just joined by the way say hi let me know where you're dialing in from we got um, we got Jam we got Monica Monica one of, one of our investors is joined so she's um, uh, come on thank you so much for investing in our mission and our vision uh, Ming Lin says, Loyal will love the dog. Um, how do we invest? Okay, so at the bottom of this, you're going to see a URL. So the URL is called www.wdipo.com. Wdipo.com. And when you go there, there's going to be a link. Uh, put your first name, last name, email address, telephone number, and put the amount you would like to invest. Once you hit submit, our team will receive that and we'll give you a call. Now, we don't let any, just anybody invest. We have to speak to every single one of you to make sure that you love our mission, you want you know, us to, to do well, because we want people to invest for the right reasons. 
And, you know, some people, they're investing for the wrong reasons. And, you know, we just want everybody to be as supportive of what we do. And also, for, and if you've been following my work for many years now, I don't know how long you guys have been following us, um, but maybe you've, you've you know, seen a lot of stuff that we do. Jen Campbell says, how, what's the minimum you can invest, please? Jen, I would just go to the link, www.wdipo.com. In fact, you can see it pinned right there. So if you just go to that website now, or just do it, uh, once you finish, so WD for Wealth Dragons, then IPO.com. Um, are you a private company or going public? So we, is- we are actually a public company already. We incorporated into a PLC uh, back in June last year. But it's a public company that's not been officially uh, uh, listed in the stock exchange. Um, so... So we are a public company, but we're not a listed company until we list. Yeah, and we'll be doing that this year. And this is a chance for all of you to be part of this. And let me ask you all a question. How many times in your entire life have you been able to invest in a company before it goes public? You see, if you'd have known this from either Google or Facebook or YouTube or all these big companies that have, have, that have gone and, and listed, you probably would have done it because... Most of the times, not all of the time, most of the times when companies go public, what normally happens to the share price? Normally. Up, of course. Yeah, but obviously we can't guarantee that. No, no. but uh, we, we know that our investors so far have invested in company not because they want to make a quick buck. They're not looking to sell their shares. They have really bought into our vision. They, they want to invest uh, to see um, our, our objectives being met. So ma- many people are not going to sell the shares. Now, we know that while we run our seminars moving forward, a lot of people will get to know about Wealth Dragons. They want to buy the shares through the stockbrokers on the open market. Then unless people sell the shares, they're not going to be able to buy. And hence what's going to happen to the share price is going to go up because it's about supply and demand. Not that it's something that is within our control, but this is what we see happening is that our investors are not really looking to sell. So the shares would be kind of limited but mm. um but we can see um the the, the demand is going to outstrip the supply awesome we've got so hail con hey my good friend long time no see good luck guys saw my business for eight figures last year so know the feeling good job very well done uh, malaysian people love you many uh, uh sub investment company great job um oh we got jen uh, the link is not going through john okay so then what I'll do is let me give you a number. So this number, uh, zero, because I think everybody's going through at the same time, 07958-877-204. So 07958-877-204, right? So that number that I've just put there, you can add me to uh, WhatsApp, okay? So if you just WhatsApp that number, that'll go through to Marcus. I've just put the number there, 07958 eight seven seven two zero four um and then just message me and and then we'll send you the link to apply okay um copy and paste the link it's not a url oh yes that's right uh thank you Carlos. you have to do that so you have to go to um the address bar now this is a private link please do not give this to anybody this is only for my community so you have to go to the google address bar and type in www.wdipo.com we've got milan doshi that's watching long time hey Hey. yo milan (laughs) how's your son doing in uh, manchester i think yeah hope he's doing well and welcome to my home yeah it's um beautiful i I love and stuff because it's just like when i come here it's just and that's oh. the well where we put naughty children and um, bad people. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. So, yeah, those of you that want to be involved, this is really your last chance. Now, the EIS, for those of you that, that, that missed it earlier, uh, by the way, everyone just type in the word EIS for me. EIS. Milan says, hi, guys. How are you doing? Yeah, good. good. I was offered to sit here. This is this all right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Right. So... Um, Aaron says, what was the website? The website is www.wdipo.com, right? Coffee's getting cold. Coffee's getting cold. All right, that's it. The decaf tastes a bit, a bit weird. It doesn't, does it not taste, taste like, weird. It doesn't taste like coffee. It's coffee. What are you talking about? It tastes nice. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Cecilia says, nice place. We've got people watching from Hong Kong. By the way, where are you guys watching from? Uh, just type in where you're actually dialing in from. All right. Um, oh, we got a lot. 
Uh, what's some investment? Taiwan is a great place for you guys. Yeah, I'm coming to Taiwan at the end of the year. We've got. Um, I want to see if the peacock is here. Letty Nagella says Lei Ho. Lei Ho. I think, I, I think that means Lei Ho in Chinese. How are you? Um, Koi says, How do we invest? Yeah, you need to go to the website and just type in WDIPO.com. Uh, uh, what is the share price for Wealth Dragons and what is the minimum amount of money you can invest? The share price currently right now is £1.50 per share. So a lot of it's cold outside, isn't it? Yeah. It's minus three outside, it's crazy. crazy. Yeah, so the, the, the minimum um, investment, you'll need to go to www.wdipo.com or just message that number there. So if you want to invest, the deadline for investing in Wealth Dragons under EIS scheme, which means anything you invest into Wealth Dragons, you'll be able to claim back a 30% tax relief. So that means, let's say you invest 100,000, 30,000 of that um, investment will be, you'll be able to offset against your next tax bill. All right, we've got Katie McNaughton. Katie, how you doing? Hope you're well. Hello, Katie. Uh, Katie's an amazing, uh, uh, one of our huge assets in Wealth Dragon. She's amazing. She does all of our events. Anyone who's not connected with Katie, get connected with Katie. Uh, Morocco, if you can come to Morocco, I can organize an event for you guys. Uh, Anas, please send an email to my PA, Diane Saint at wealthdragons.co.uk. Uh, we've got Daniel Sesta. Hey, Daniel, how you doing? We've got Marcus, we've got Jen from Campbell, we've got Stephanie from Manchester, uh, Ian from KL, hello guys, hope you're well. Kevin from Texas, we've got Lubna from Oxford, UK. By the way, if you enjoy this, by the way, give me a thumbs up and type in yes. And do me a favor, in the bottom left-hand corner, uh, share this post and uh, so we can impact more lives. Right, so Vince, I'm just going to, we're going to end this now because I know we yeah. need to get on to a, a quick meeting. But I want you to leave uh, one last word of why people should be investing their money instead of spending it. Well, um, we all work hard for our money. So you either work hard for it or you let money work hard for you. And I will have to say that if, if you really want to create wealth, you want money to work very hard and, and squeeze the last drop out of it. And that's through intelligent investing. You want to invest in companies that you know about, you want to invest in companies that are, have a great plan with the great people behind it. And here's an opportunity. You either leave your money in a bank for which you earn nothing and you let the banks make the money for themselves and pay themselves big, you know, uh, pay packet, or you invest in a company that will make money for you and make a, a difference in people's lives as well. Yeah. You know, one of the things that, that inspired me about Vince and how he even came up with this idea is, you know, uh, Vince's daughter at the age of nine years old started her first eggs business. She buys eggs for a pound and sells them for £1.50, which is amazing. She makes £35 a week just from selling eggs. Now imagine if all... Oh, no. Twice that. Is it twice that? Yeah. Right? Yeah, she's, she's, she's doing all right now. I remember there's one time she was in Hamleys. So you tell me the story about yeah, Hamleys. Goes, yeah, um, she, so she picked up this massive doll. And uh, so as a dad, what do you do? At the checkout, you, you pull out your wallet to pay, right? And then she, she looked at me, she goes... Dad, I said, yes. She goes, it's all right. I've got money, she goes. I thought, what do you mean you've got money? You're, you're eight years old. And then she pulled out her wallet and just got 350 quid in there, cash. Yeah. I said, where'd you get the money from? And she said, I earned this through my egg business. She's been saving up. So yeah. I, guess, I guess that's a good thing that these days, in, a, in an age of entitlement, um, everything is like instant gratification. You have some children who will work hard and they understand um, the idea of putting value in things um, and also knowing the difference between revenue, profit, cash flow uh, and how to sell. And I think these are things that children need to learn right, right from the start. You know, I went to business school, I came out with an MBA, I didn't even know how to start a business. I know how corporate um, strategies and stuff like that work. but. You know, entrepreneurship is something that you need to start young. Absolutely. Yeah. You know, and you know, this goes for all of you. You know, you, you want to become a leader to your kids, a leader to your children, and, and lead by example. You know, let your kids do what they want to do, what they're passionate about, but give them the education and what it takes to do that. And we got Dara says, look how he lit up. This is a proud father. <laughs> yeah. Yes, he is. So, but we want to do that for the next generation. So if you believe in our mission, if you love the idea of uh, us helping Billions of people around the world with education, with stuff that not is 
street smart or it's so not book smart but street smart stuff i find a lot of people that graduate from university now have no idea how life works mm-hmm. you know they graduate with debt and you know we we, we, we want to change that we want to teach people the necessary skills which is about money confidence you know self-development we want to teach these skills that were never taught at school and we're going to do this through wealth dragons online so if you love the idea of that if you love the business model and if you believe in what Vince and I do, you can follow me for some time on Facebook or social media or through our events. Then I invite you to invest in Wealth Dragons with me and Vincent. You let us do the hard work to make you money. That's all you have to do. So if you want to do this, just go to www.wdipo.com or you can text us on or you can do a WhatsApp on zero. Our number is, write this down, 07. Nine five eight eight seven seven two zero four. All right, it's been amazing. I've enjoyed this. Since you enjoyed this, Same here. right? Yes. And um, those of you who've already invested already, thank you so much for supporting our mission, our vision. Vince and I and our entire team would do whatever it takes to take Wealth Dragons to a billion dollar company and to impact many more lives. It's John Lee, the author of Wealth Dragon Way. Vincent, one, the author of Property Entrepreneur. And uh, bye for now. Bye.